Now, moving on from there, just um, last week, we tell you of NLC and the strike and where they actually commenced. As at last week, Thursday, now the strike actually commenced. Now, we yes, the Nigeria Labour Congress will actually suspend their ongoing nationwide strike following promises by the federal government to reconvene the tripartite um, committee on national minimum wage on top of October 4th. Now, the suspension of the warning strike actually take effect from today. So nobody should be, uh, make, make nobody fear because now they don't suspend the strike. Now, announcing the decision in Abuja on Sunday, the NLC president, Webi Ayubawaba, actually come as I state, said the labor action was suspended to enable the committee to hold their crucial meeting and conclude um, their work. Now, waiting they don't come as I told. Now, let's not forget, say, the three labor union don't actually demand for 65,500 as the new minimum wage for workers, while the private employers and some state governors, they come as I talk, say, we now go fit pay 65,000 naira. We cannot. We can only pay 25,000 naira. Now, within some private employers and even some state governors, they come as I talk. Why some they come as I talk say they can pay 25,000, others they come as I talk say even the 80,000, we cannot pay. That's very now. We know say across the states now we have a lot of states that are owing workers' salary, even with the eighteen thousand naira minimum mm -hmm. wage. Now, but they listen when some people they come outside, they give their own opinions on the street on waiting people or waiting the government need to do. Now, A don't talk say the no fit do past twenty five thousand. Yeah. B talk say the minimum wage they want start with now sixty five thousand. A common ground supposed happen, and this common ground are options where the two parties supposed sit down. Put on for table. Do we need a unified minimum wage, or do we need a benchmark for minimum wage? That We're setting, waiting, for. setting a, a benchmark in the sense where say they're not yes. supposed to go below this amount. But if you can pay higher, better for your state. If you pay higher, it means you attract more people to come work for your state. It means say, wait, it means say they attract more development and more business um, economic opportunities with you rush to go your state. But if you choose to go. To stay at the minimum will be bottom, bottom port. And it's a way you see if it will take her. I think the major problem still remains that the 18,000 some states cannot still pay it. So is that an excuse? Major problem. Oh, wait, but, so really, but, but, but really, is that an excuse? Because if you check these states now, the government, so the governors of those states are not collecting 18,000 naira as minimum wage. The governors for those states, they collect their allowances, including waiting, including a, a sitting allowance, that they collect them steadily. They go home with millions of money. But we never hear of, say, any of these people come and say they need to review the salaries where they collect. Very sad. Nigeria, we are 58. I will continue to talk until the end of this show. We are 58. We need to open our eye, right? To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.